Hello everyone, um, this is Artifacts. Um, in this video I'm going to show you the new features included in the Windows Movie Maker 2.6 Enhancement Pack 2010. As you can see from my screen, uh, the interface is a little bit different. The video preview controls kind of resemble those of uh, Windows Media Player 11 in Vista. And also the watermarks and the file manager have been changed. Now let's start by exploring my favorite part of this program. Uh, the new added effects. So let's go to that. As you can see, the library is uh, greatly expanded. Uh, it has a, approximately over 400 effects. Yes, that's right, you heard correct. 400 effects. So if you download this program yourself, you can mess around with all the effects. Uh, I'm going to go to the transitions library now. Like the effects library. The transitions library also has a lot of effects. Well, not as many as only 75, but it's still more than what were originally in it. And the last thing that I'm going to show you is the titles and credits library. And obviously by the title, you know that this function or this library allows you to put titles and credits on your videos. So I'm going to go to that and I'm going to show you some of the new effects that were added to it. There. I just added an image overlay to this video. And as you can see in the top left corner, it's a TV rating. Cool, isn't it? Now let's try another one. And that was a light burst effect. There are eight of them in this package, so that's pretty cool. One last thing that I'm going to show is uh, that this program can render in HD. Uh, originally it couldn't because uh, Microsoft never gave it the rendering profiles to do so, but um, yeah, this package includes rendering profile profiles in order to do that.